Hello, everyone! RBG Kim Kid here, back with some more Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. In the previous video, we wrapped up uh, Vicious Voodoo, and now we're off to, to China, China to fight out. King Panda. Let's go! Hopefully I do just as well, you know, besides the final boss of that last area. Let's hope we do better in this time around than time I did, uh, needing to study up on. or as I did in the last part, so. Born penniless, he was fascinated by the fireworks rich noblemen set off every New Year's. He spent a decade learning the art. But when he tried to offer his fireworks to the noblemen, they couldn't see past his shabby clothes and chased him away. Humiliated, the Panda King took revenge on those who shunned him by using the very tools of his art for crime. The Fetish Five recruited him as their demolitions expert, and from then on, his explosive touch became feared worldwide. He's rumored to be perfecting some new firework technique high in the unstable Kunlun Mountains of western China. Fire in the... Right, let's do this. A perilous ascent. Okay, sure. Always reminds me of something from like one of the old PlayStation 1 games. Would you look at that? A fireworks show! Oh my gosh, that's awful! That poor village just got buried in freezing snow! The rocket came from that giant statue. And you can bet the Panda King lit the fuse. I've got to find my way up there and fast before that lunatic squashes another town. Oh, I never noticed that the... The... Oh, well, fuck you. I never noticed that the coins are... I wonder if they, the coins are different when you're in... A, depends on what area you're in. Because you see, this, these coins have, like, panda claw, I would assume that's what that is. I guess I never really paid attention to it. Gotten like a bottle in that area. No idea. I just want to be sure. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm sorry, but what? <laughs> I don't like the fact that I haven't seen any bottles yet. Well, not yet, but like recently. Fuck off! Fuck off! Bullshit! Ah, uh, bullshit. Fuck off. Look at that, the fireworks. Oh my god. Oh, fuck off. Oh. 
Oh yeah, I was supposed to say, are you serious? I have to hit the whole thing again. It's like, yeah, I guess. It makes sense considering I fucking died. Let's redo the entire level, so it makes sense. Fuck you! <sighs> Bullshit. Nope, not risking it. These are fucking ninjas, so... I hate that it looks like I was sliding. I was like, I'm sliding over there somehow. the last bottle. Yeah, it's up there with the... I need one more bottle. Thank God that some of these balls are somewhat easy to find. Press the circle to enter the vault code. Yes, Vent Bentley, you don't I have to keep telling me. I have a real headache figuring this one out. Input five seven eight. I get a real headache every single time you say it's circle to get into the thing, even though I know to do that. Sixty percent, man. 
I wonder if that also counts the time this attack. Just gets better and better. I'd always heard that one of your southern ancestors, Huckleberry Cooper, developed a technique to move while staying invisible. Hold down the circle button to turn invisible, then move around with the left analog stick. Oh wow. Got all that right up like Yeah, but you move super slow and like that's the caveat. Yeah, and the one in the one Sly Cooper game that I have beaten and completed on the V the Vita version of it. There's a PlayStation 3 version of it. Uh, it's, it's the fourth one, which we will do a let's play of that eventually. Um, that is uh, one that I did do. Uh, they have something like that as well. Near the hill. Obstructed by this reinforced ceiling hatch. No problem. They seem to have plenty of firepower around here. I'll just have to find a few more treasure keys to get at it. All right, flaming temple of flame. That's the deadly death of dance. The deadly dance of death. Despite its temple-like facade, this place is really some sort of training ground. Stay on your toes. Oh, 25. And, no, no, there's 20. I was about to say, I think 25 is the lowest we've ever seen. Nah, I completely forgot that there were 20. Bottles. I know bottles. Ah, oh, here we are. Here's bottles. Bottles. Like the guy from Banjo Kazooie. Man. I definitely, at some point, I need to do the the upgrade. The upgrade for uh, the Nintendo Switch Online expansion pass so I can play N64 games because I would love to play, like, Banjo-Kazooie. I think Banjo-Tooie's on there now. I honestly don't remember. 
But I'd also love to, you know, do a let's play of Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Of course, all the other games are on 64. I was gonna do. I was gonna get that when my like when it was time for me to like renew. But I was like, ah. I have so many things on the pipeline right now, so it's something I'm not going to worry about for now, anyway. In the future, though. the sounds that they are giving. They're loud and obnoxious. Glad I was holding circle. I thought I had to. Uh. Oh, that is the way to go. It's that way, but obviously I want to get the bottles, so there's some more bottles. I need to go. I don't understand why. I thought it would be like going on the rails, but I guess that doesn't count for that one. Well, nah, 11 more to go, and then good. I know there's at least is there two or three up in that one area close to the beginning that you know, didn't get to yet because I mean I'm pretty sure we'll get there right now but still as long as I don't have to go through some of the bullshit that I've already gone through again so that pandas were controlling monkeys.
two more. Maybe they're right by the safe, so that'd be great. Great, I'm at the end and I don't have them. Son of a bitch. Okay. I've just done this. Oh, well, that's food for thought when I have to go through this again because I can't find the last two bottles. And they're probably over on that side somewhere. annoying trek up yeah I should have paid attention that was my fault I 
good news is it's not too bad to go all the way back there. Oh, 932. I don't know why I saw it said 993. Incredible! I never would have thought this was possible. Sir Augustine of Cooper's technique to briefly defy gravity. From now on, you should be able to pop right out of those bottomless pits you keep falling into. And you won't even lose a lucky charm. Now that's good. So it seems like the only thing I'll lose damage for is by getting hit. I'm a-okay with that. Bombless pits and uh, water? Hells yeah, no more damage for me. King of the Hill. Oh, is this yep, another Bentley protection a one. For the key. While or on Murray. the blasting station, use the left analog stick to aim and the square button to fire. Right on. I'll keep him covered. Let's do it, Sly. No! Hit him. Oh, fuck you. Oh, 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 oh,
Wow. That was much better than the first one I had done with these where he got hit multiple, multiple, multiple times, but he only got hit once in this one, even though I think that one was bullshit, but eh. Let's do it one more time. The unseen foe. Okay. Thirty, okay. This looks like a good place to try out your new invisibility move. Hold down the circle button to drop out of sight. While invisible, nothing can see you. Not lasers, not searchlights, not guards. Oh, and if the guards already see you, then the invisibility trick won't work on them. No, I was about to say, it's like, it's so weird how it's like, oh, yeah, we like it. Yo, thank God I found that one. So yeah, now the only things that'll kill me is just getting hit or hurt me anyway. Actually, yeah, this is the last one for this part, isn't it?
I would see you being able to blow rockets, would you? Ah! Mm -hmm. Oh no! Again, thank God for that. On that. Let me try that again. Oh, nope, that was way too bad of a jump. I think I gotta jump like right away. I can't wait. Cause I don't I really don't get an extra height with my double jump. I got from this. Oh, fuck off! First of all, I did get up there, but it's like, it, it's that weird, like, crouching theme where it's like, oh yeah, I'm like. Is that weird, like, oh, it's like when he's at the edge of a thing? It doesn't, I mean, it does count. Ah, fuck it. I'm sure there's, like, a proper way to get up there. I just wanted to, like, sequence break. I guess sequence break isn't the right way, but you know what I mean. come back here so I didn't miss it. Fly, this pagoda is some kind of huge gunpowder production plant. Judging by the scale, the Panda King must be making tons of explosives! Um, the fuck? I didn't even see the fucking safe! I must have missed it somewhere. Well, let's go through it once more so I can get this, the code, which I'm going to guess is going to be... I want to make sure that's all the ones... Yep, just want to make sure that was the last one. My guess is that this is going to be the one where I it will show me all the areas, right? Or show me all the things. Just want to make sure I didn't forget it over here. Oh, that was close. 
Chelsea. Double checking to make sure I have. Oh, I haven't missed a uh, thing. Checking. Not on this tree, but on that tree? If it's on that tree, I might be a little bit mad. I mean, it doesn't look like it is, but I'll double check once I actually get this guy out of the way. Nope, okay, just want to be sure. I still don't even know where the safe's at. I didn't even see it anywhere. Right here, I'd be a little mad because, like, how the fuck did I miss that when it was literally like right in front of me? Yeah, 
I'm way on the return trip. There's like a bottle or something. Let me see. Nope. Because yeah, that won't make sense for there to be a bottle on that way. I would have noticed that. See the safe. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, I'm an idiot. It's right here. There we go. I'm an idiot. Press the circle to enter the vault code. I know. It was a challenge. But this vault's combination has got to be six, six, seven. Boom. Got it. You found the blueprints for the Panda King's lair. I'll upload the data straight into your Monocucom. See, I was right. Meaning the ancestors. Is that by getting all of those? I don't know. We'll see. Alright. Oh, I Alrighty. All right, guys, that is going to do it for this part of Let's Play Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. In the next part, guys, we will unload some fireworks onto these fools. So thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give the like button a click. And comment down below if you like about the video, didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what you think about uh, this area. I actually really like it. I, I did a little mess ups every now and then. But hey, at least the good news is I won't die from falling into the pits and into the water. Yay. So, yeah. And as always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to the main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, the RPG Kim Kids Twitter, are in there, too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. And I'll see you all next time.